Tom Aspinall just flattened Sergei Pavlovich out cold in round one. Beat him at his own fucking game. I cannot believe what I just witnessed. Tom Aspinall went out there and just fucking did it. He fucking laid Sergei Pavlovich out cold. Badly. Beat him at his own fucking game. Wow. Unbelievable. Tom Aspinall is a fucking savage. Just went out there and fucking KO'd Sergei Pavlovich out cold. I like the main event. Pereira won, but this one just stole the whole night. Aspinall just made himself a superstar. With one performance, all thanks to John Jones, because... I mean, we can say what we... I think Aspinall smokes Jones. I'll get to that in a second. And I'll make an early I'll make an early prediction. A quick one now in this video. And I'll make a whole in-depth one tomorrow. Because why not? But Tom Aspinall just made himself a superstar. All thanks to Jones. Because if Jones didn't pull out and fought Stipe tonight... You know? <coughs> we wouldn't have saw Tom Aspinall put a fucking... Easy work, pay, easy work, not even, but easy work. He just put on a fucking easy win, easiest win of his career. What the fuck? Easy win from Tom Aspinall. Unbelievable. Unfucking believe, unfucking believable. He's a savage. He's a savage. I picked Tom Aspinall to win by submission. I thought he needed the ground game. To get the work done here. But he fucking needed the striking. Put away Pavlovich. I feel bad for Pavlovich man. Because he was close to just getting that world title. And arguably should have gotten it against Jones already. But Aspinall just put all that to the fucking back of the line. And he goes in the front. And he better face Jones next. If Stipe. There's no way they can give it to Stipe. There's no way. There's no way. It's got to be Aspinall or you do Aspinall Stipe in the UK for the interim title and have Aspinall defend it. If Stipe wins, he can get it. But Stipe has no fucking chance. I will bet my fucking life on it. Yeah, I'll bet my life on it. I'll actually... Not my life. That's a bit too far. I'll bet everything I own on it. I'll bet everything I own on it. I dare Stipe Miocic to go out there and win. You don't have a chance... Stipe, you will get fucking destroyed by every single... F I think everyone beats Stipe. The only person he beats in the rankings is maybe Derek Lewis. Even then, like, I think Lewis can just catch him. Everyone beats him. Everyone beats Stipe. I think Almeida beats him as well. Oh, the fuck? He could beat Almeida, though. Because Almeida has so many holes ready to be exposed. But Stipe has no chance against him. Wow. What a win from Tom Aspinall. He is a superstar born from the UK. And we have him and Edwards as champs now. I know Tom is an interim champ. Soon will be the champion of the heavyweight division. They gotta do him versus Stipe next. I don't know what the UFC is gonna do though. Because I know they said, oh, John Stipe is a big fight. We don't care, man. That has no hype on it. Unless see, Tom fights the winner. Which I doubt. Because I think Jones just wants Stipe in to dip afterwards. Because he's a pussy bitch. Fucking bitch. Roy abusing fuck. Would get smoked by Asp now in under a round. If you pick Jones. If you think Jones wins that, you're a fucking casual dick sucking retard. Fuck. I just said the fucking fuck. I'm getting copyrighted in this video. Who cares though? I'm just so fucking, I hate that people think Joan beats him, because he doesn't. I said the R word, though. Who gives a fuck? Um, who cares? John Jones would get absolutely smoked. I think he does, because Jones won out grapple, Tom. There's no way of that. I know Jones is different in grappling, but gone is an actual weak retard. Oh, no, I said it again. It's such a, it's such a, why is that copyrighted word on YouTube? Fuck you, platform. Oh, what do I say instead, you bitch? I'll just say bitch. You dick sucking, you fucking weakling bitch. Cyril gone. No one's gonna, like, wow, you beat Spivak. 
Well done, dude. You turned down Aspen Allen Pavlovich. You don't get shit, Cyril Gunn. And you got out grappled by Jones. Aspen would out grapple Jones, in my opinion. I think if Jones tries wrestling with him, Aspen can fucking sweep him down. Be honest with you, I think he can. Aspen stronger than Jones, bigger than Jones, bigger frame than Jones. He can get into more shape easier than Jones. He fucking KOs Jones on the feet with one, two, and puts Jones out cold. Face plant. Fuck Jones. He would absolutely get destroyed. Um, I even think Pavlovich can give him a run for his money as well. Sucks for Pavlovich, though. Does suck for Sergey Pavlovich. He'll be back, though. Get another week. Like, if I'm numb, this is what I would do. You do. Right now in the heavyweight division, you do. In March, O'Malley versus... T- O'Malley Vera 2 is such a hogging up pay-per-view. That doesn't have to be the main event. I'm going to be honest with you. That can be a co-main event. Volkanovski to Puria. I get O'Malley main event, whatever, it's O'Malley. But Volkanovski to Puria should not be the main event. That should be the co-main event you have in February. You have... Or you do in May. I mean, those are two hogging up pay-per-views. But maybe in May you have... They yeah, go back to the UK... With Ashton Allen Stipe. Alright. What do you do with Gon? Do Gon Pavlovich. Next September. Hear me out here. Next September in Paris. Then you do Jail to Now Made of Curtis Blades. Because I know Mal- I just said it doesn't make sense to rebook that. But he's still higher ranked than you in the rankings. You still will get something out of that. Beating Curtis Blades. So rebook that fight. Who cares about them though? Gon Pavlovich. In Paris, you do in May after we all we get through the first half of the year, like after three hundred, we do UFC three hundred one with Pavlovich no, not pa- with Aspinall versus Stipe. I know Stipe said he only wants Jones, but I don't care. I don't care. Pay Stipe lots to take that fight. In my opinion, I say pay him a fucking grand ten mil. Just to take that fight and say, you know what, Stipe, train as hard as you can. If you win against Aspinall, because we can't really give you a title shot over the interim chat now. But we also can, we can't just, just ignore you. So get, take on Aspinall. If you win, you get Jones immediately. If you lose, we'll still have you in the mix. If not, if you don't want to continue anymore, you retire. It's what I would do with that. Do Stipe versus Tom. Stipe gets absolutely fucking destroyed. But you do that fight next. Stipe versus Tom. Is what I would do. That's what you do next. Yeah. And then Jones can face the winner in MSG again. In my opinion. Or do it later that year. I don't know when. But still. Maybe you do it in... I don't even know where you did it. On September, maybe? I don't know. But do that fight next. Aspinall versus Pav... Uh, Stipe. Sucks for Pavlovich, though. I'm sure he didn't expect that. He actually cracked pa- Aspinall early on. I was like, oh, shit. Pavlovich is going to fucking KO him. But no. Aspinall lands the combos. Was faster in there. Good win from Aspinall. I'm happy I switched to him. I'm think I'm really thankful. Because, I mean, it probably would have been more shocking for me. It was still shocking for me. He KO'd Pavlovich. I didn't expect that. I thought you'd take him down and then sub him in the first round. But he got a first round KO. Good win from Aspinall. You do him versus Stipe next. If Stipe wants to play games... Jelson Almeida, I know you... No, they're not going to give him a title shot. He's boring. He beat Derek Lewis. And he's not even that highly ranked. They do Aspinall gone. But if I'm Aspinall, I'd be like, fuck you, gone. You had your chance to fight me. You declined. And now he's going to be higher ranked than your fucking French ass. Fuck you, Cyril gone. You don't deserve shit. Yeah, go fucking fuck yourself. You can't even win a title. Will you beat Derek Lewis to win your title? Pavlovich is a way better win than Lewis. 
So if I'm after I'd be, I'd be saying, I'll wait out for Jones if Stipe declines. I think he should only accept Stipe, but Aspinall, he'll accept anyone. He'll smoke Jones. Because, listen, Jones doesn't have shit on the feet. He's slow on the feet, not great on the feet. He doesn't have any power in his hands. That's the one weakness. That's one thing Jones just doesn't have is power in his hands. Oh, Jones has a good chin. Pavlovich arguably has a better chin. And Temple shots are existent in here. Jones won't outgrapple him. He could bug the knee of Saspinal, but I don't know can pop shots. Reyes was hurting you and beating you up. Reyes. I wonder what Aspinal is going to do. Reyes is way more, way tinier. Way tinier. Aspinal's going to fucking smoke him. I cannot wait. Jones can run. He can, he can hide. Yeah. Yeah. Aspinal's a savage. Savage. UK has three champs. I know Bisping, former champion Bisping. Edwards is going to beat Colby, in my opinion, and retain the title. We're going to have a massive UK event. We're going to have fucking, in my opinion, maybe Edwards Muhammad main event number two rematch. No, 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 that's not the main event. Fuck off. That's going to be the co-main event. Main event's going to be Pavel... Uh, what am I saying Pavel? No. Aspinall versus Miocic is the main event for the interim title. As interim champ Tom Aspinall defends against the challenger, Stipe. And, yeah. I wonder what Tatum Woods going to say now. He might be doing the post fight press conference right now. We'll see. We'll see what they do. I don't care if Stipe is disrespectful to the fucking interim. I don't give a fuck. Fuck Stipe. He's been out for two, three years. I'm going to just say that now. Three years. Has done nothing. You know? People calling Ganu inactive. You know? They did. But Stipe hasn't fought since the fucking... Since fucking 2020. One. 2021. That's how, that's how some he's fought. He's been fighting forever. Where has he been at? Where has he been at? Fuck him. Alright. Oh, disrespectful to give CP an interim title shot. I don't give a fuck, though. Alright. He didn't get an interim title shot, but Tom gets the real title shot. Tom deserves it more. He's been active. He beat Marcin Tybura and Sergei Pavlovich. Back to back. Blades fluked a knee injury win over him. Because Aspinall realistically would have fucking smoked Blades, a stupid, dumb, mumbling bitch ass. <sighs> Stuttering bitch ass, also, I'm going to add in there as well. Pavlovich is a bit... Why do I think Pavlovich? Just a head. Like, I'm just shocked that Pavlovich got knocked out. Aspinall should be the one in my head. Aspinall wins. He's a savage. Fuck, I said some slurs in this video, but who cares? Who cares? Yeah. Good performance by fucking Aspinall. I picked him to win, and I'm happy I did as well. I picked Pereira as well to win as well. I picked both of them. I got them both right. I don't even know what I got wrong, right, right and wrong in this card. Well, I got Sabatini wrong, but who cares? I just... I legit put a Hail Mary on him to win, and he lost. Whatever. Favola lost. Favola beats Dober, but can't beat St. Denis. Interesting. Yeah. I got Andrade wrong as well. Or I got Darren wrong as well. So I got those three wrong. The rest of the card I think I got right though. Yeah, I think I got the rest of the card right. So I only got those three wrong. Yeah, so it sucks for me. I only got those three wrong. Yeah, Darren, Frivola, and Sabatini. I was looking good this card though. Really looked good this card. I went 10 and 3. Aspinall's a fucking savage. God bless this man. Fuck yes. I'm so happy. He's my top. He's in my top five favorite fighters now. After that, he's entertaining. You never see Aspinall a boring fight. I think my top five is probably Charles Oliveira, Alex Pereira. This is not in order, by the way. This is just random. But Charles Oliveira, Alex Pereira. I guess you can have Yuri in there as well. Yuri can be in there as well. Um, I really liked his fight versus Pereira. 
Um, and then Aspinall can go in there as well. And then I know I know I have top three favorites. Top those are my four favorites though. Who's my other favorite? Fucking who's the heavyweight champ? Jones? No, fuck him. Middleweight champ is Strickland. Strickland can go in there as well. Strickland. Welterweight has Edwards. He's not. He's boring to watch. To be honest with you. So yeah, those are my top five favorites. Oliveira. Um, Pereira. Um, Yuri. But Yuri doesn't fight often. <sighs> Should I add it? Should I keep Yuri in there? He doesn't fight often, Yuri. Who's Bantamweight? O'Malley. Boy, O'Malley. No. Folk. Folk, folk, folk. That's it, that's it. Oliveira, Pereira. Um, Volk. You can go in there as well. Um, Yuri doesn't fight often. Volk fights a lot. Volk in there. So, Oliveira, Pereira, Volk, Strickland, Aspinall. Top five favorites. Not in order, but those are my top five favorites now. Good one from Aspinall. Like, subscribe, thank you for watching. Aspinall is a savage. Love this man. Peace.